Okay, so the I've already pulled the wadding out. There's no reason for you to sit here and watch me do all that. So, wadding's already there. That was everything that came out of there. Um, so you can see it's quite a bit. It's going to have to go back in. So now I'm going to pull some wire here and go ahead and get the wick ready. This is the wire I'm using. Um, 0.3 millimeter silver beading wire. Um, you know, I'm going to use a pretty good length of it more than I need just to make sure. Um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and cut that off. book of in the article we're going to take cut this down long sloping angle about like that okay now we're going to take this wire it's like we we're going to tie our shoes and we're just going to tie one single knot just like that that's it. You're going to lay that down under, below the thickest part, or right on the thickest part, hopefully. Now, right here, take that. Let's see, we may have to adjust a little bit as we go. But, pull that through. And then we're gonna just pull that as tight as we can. Now, we're gonna take on both sides. Okay, so here we go. Got the wire, we got the wick, the wire tied on. We're gonna feed that down through here. Hopefully pull it right on out. There we go. Okay, so easy enough there. Keep that back. I'm gonna guide that down in there in place so you know it's going in right. And just pull it right on down in there. Um, keep you enough up there. Make sure you don't pull it to where you're gonna yank it out of there. Now let's go ahead and get the rest of this wadding. Let's go ahead and trim this wick. Uh, 